dimmed the light on me when they took my son away from me. Y'all dimmed my light. A mother grieves for her young son. Philadelphia police say he was shot and killed after answering a knock at the door of his Frankfurt home. Good evening, I'm Jill Holden. Family members say 12-year-old Sadiq Clark Harrison was loved in his neighborhood. His future was bright, they said, through unimaginable grief. Now they're planning his funeral and are pressuring police to find this child's killer. Our Dan Koob starts us off. It took my baby away from me. Yes. He was a good boy. He yes, was he a good was. boy. He helped and she's everybody a around yeah. him. Lisa Clark is grief stricken. She says her son, 12 year old Sadiq Clark Harrison, is the boy that police say was shot in the face and killed around 3 a.m. on the 5000 block of Dittman Street. Authorities are hopeful the community can help them solve this ongoing case as investigators were out Sunday. Clark says neighbors have security cameras that could solve the crime, and whoever did this came to Clark's porch, according to police, and fired a single shot through the crescent moon glass of the front door. She says, she heard a grown man's voice yell out prior to the gunshot. Sidney, Sidney. So he was coming outside to answer the door because we they were calling his you. name. We forgive and then he you. Went and he looked. He didn't even open the door. He looked at the top of the door and it shot him through his eye. Sadiq is the youngest of Lisa's four sons. Neighbor Tony Cologne says the boy recently helped save his life after a diabetic episode. It's not a crime because that kid is a good kid. You know what I mean? I see them grow up. I know they failed mainly for years. It's another tragic incident of a minor lost to gun violence. Sadiq's aunt says enough is enough. I'm going uh, to City Hall. Uh, we're showing up tomorrow and we're going to yes. kick down them doors because our kids is dying out here. Yes, we They're are. Dying. Yeah. They're not making it back. They're They're dying out here. I'm foster. so upset that they took him away from me because he was going to be somebody out here. Dan Koob, CBS3 Eyewitness News.